All right, check out our new sponsor, Greenwood Stocks. They want you to know how to be able to trade stocks and be your own boss and be free to travel the world by making passive income. We all need that passive income from stock market. What are you waiting for? Call and text 281-760-3170. If you didn't catch that, that's on your screen. Or check them out at social media, Greenwood Stocks, and catch them at Gmail, Greenwood Stock Trading at Gmail, and the YouTube channel is Greenwood Stocks. Appreciate them for giving me the opportunity. Check them out. We out. All right, we're going to talk about Lamar Jackson in a minute. How no receiver wants to play for with Lamar Jackson. And unfortunately, and unfortunately, those receivers that don't want to play with him are black. But we're gonna talk about that in a minute. So hit that subscribe button, bell icon like, button, share the video, check out the NFL playlist. First, we're gonna talk about how the 49ers made another trade today. We talked about the first one. And um, let's get to it. Share the video for your boy. It's the best way to donate to the channel. But um, um so obviously, if you didn't know, the Dolphins traded the number three pick. They got the Larry Thompson trade from the Houston Texans uh, to the 49ers. So now they're picking third. Presumably, they're going to take a quarterback for the number 12 pick. And also, they picked up two future firsts and I think a compensatory third that the 49ers had. They want to give you all this, this article, but just give me the picks, right? So, yeah, they got the 12 pick and two in the first. In the third and the 22 and the first and the 23, the Dolphins. Um, then the Eagles checked in. And um, they said the 49ers had been attempting to move into the top five for several weeks now. So, so Scheffner, they, had dis they discussed the number three and five picks with the Dolphins, the Falcons, and the Bengals. Ultimately decided number three because they were satisfied with the options that will be there. After the picks by Jacksonville Jaguars and the, and the Jets. Oh, my dog. But um, I'm trying to see what the Eagles traded the pick. They got the artist article. Here we go to Twitter, man. I'm other screen. Other screen. I don't know what they're still doing. Up. I don't know if going to tell us. Uh... Marshawn Lynch got arrested. Marshawn Lattimore got arrested. He got a he got like a, a contract year coming up. So the Eagles traded the six to the Dolphins for number twelve in their twenty twenty two first round pick. Teams also swapped mid round picks. Eagles hundred fifty six number fifty hundred fifty six pick for the number hundred twenty three pick. Um, I'm guessing this year. So the Eagles traded out of the traded out of six pick for the twelfth pick, and they get a and they get a a first round pick next year and also they swap mid round pick so they move up a little bit on the 23rd pick but um you know ultimately this was this was the, all right the trade was solid um obviously the 49 i mean the uh Dolphins like somebody that's gonna be there at six and i'm presumably thinking it's probably gonna be a receiver either they gonna want chase smith or waddle and when you look at how the draft the draft is playing out Let's talk about it for a minute. I got to pull it up. So the draft is going to play out like this, right? Jacksonville is going to take Trevor Lawrence. You know, Miami traded out. Or the third pick, Jets probably going to take. If they don't trade out, let's say they take a offensive lineman per se. Let's say they take a quarterback. Quarterback, quarterback. 49ers going to take a quarterback. So we're going to have Lawrence, Wilson, and Fields going outside the top three. Atlanta, no quarterback to take. Don't be surprised if Atlanta don't take a lineman to reach for a defensive player, which really ain't no defensive player to go for. It's receiver, offensive lineman. So I think Atlanta going to reach for a lineman or somebody on defense. Cincinnati going to take a lineman, I believe. They're going to reach either for Slater or they're going to take the kid out of Oregon. Um, now Miami's in the sixth pick. I think they're going to walk away with Jamar Chase. Detroit going to be in the seventh pick. Check out my Detroit channel, Mercy Sports Talk, by the way. I don't know what they're going to do. They always do some stupid shit, but I would sit there and not take a receiver. But quarterback's going to be gone early. And the whole thing about this story, whole thing about this story is this. If that make any sense, but you don't. They, the Eagles were looking to move into the top three and take Zach Wilson. The reason they didn't move up to the top three of Miami is simply because the Jets, nobody's going to know what they do with Sam Darnold. They want to be guaranteed that they get Zach Wilson. So they didn't, they want to wait for the trade. They wanted to wait for the trade on draft day. Right. 
So, so for the most part, Miami could have walked away with Jalen Hurts, which they didn't. Which, you know, for the Eagles, thing is, they still not committed with Jalen Hurts. So the Eagles, if they could have gotten to the top three and waited, and they could have known they could have got Zach Wilson at three, they was going to move on from Jalen Hurts. So after they said they committed to Jalen Hurts, they lied. So that ain't no good look for Jeffrey Lurie, especially after the Deuce Daly situation, especially after the Riley Reeves, Riley, was it Riley uh, Cooper situation with him saying the bad words and all of that. So they ain't worried. We all know what he said. So, I mean, so they were trying to, they were trying to betray Jalen Hurts. And that ain't no good look, man, unfortunately. But um, that would have been interesting, though. You know, the media wouldn't have spent it like they would have usually spent it um, because he's a black quarterback. But, um, I'm not surprised. I mean, I, if they rank Zach Wilson that high, so be it. But you know, after Jeff Lurie came out and said that Jalen Hurts is going to be guy, they're going to try to backstab him. That would have been an interesting story. But Zach Wilson is good, though. You know, he is good. So the only thing that would have mattered was the results. If Jalen Hurts would have went somewhere and won, you know, they would look stupid and Zach Wilson didn't win. But if Zach Wilson would have been successful, Hurts wouldn't. The fans and people wouldn't have really talked about it as much. But, um, I'm tired of scratching you. But, um, I mean, you know, it is what it is. So, you got a situation where receivers don't want to play with Lamar Jackson. So, um, obviously, I don't think they offer Kenny Galloway. There no rumors of that. But T.Y. Hilton turned down Lamar Jackson for more money to go back to the Colts, play with Carson Wentz. And, um, who was it? Who was somebody else, too? Oh, Juju Smith-Schuster turned on a more lucrative multi-year deal to go back to Pittsburgh for a year. So, you know, the book out is players don't want to play with Lamar Jackson because he's a mobile quarterback and he can't get the ball to him. But to be honest, who is he throwing the ball to, you know? And, you know, they worried about being a pass-happy situation. But Lamar Jackson get you those explosive yards. So, for the most part, you got black players not wanting to play with Lamar Jackson because he can't get them the yards. But my whole thing is Kenny Galladay go to the Giants – well, Daniel Jones can't do shit neither. You know, with well, Carson Wentz, they're never healthy for T.Y. Hilton. So, you know, people want to understand, want to know why it's a lot of racial undertones in the NFL because the blacks won't stand up. The blacks don't want to sit here and, and do what they have to do and all that. So, you know, it's unfortunate. It's unfortunate, man, that you know the brothers don't want to play Lamar Jackson. I think Lamar Jackson, if he gets a solid quarterback, a solid uh, receiver, I think he could be an explosive quarterback and he can get them the ball. But, you know, they see the number one run defense, I mean, offense, and they don't want to sit there. That's bold, though. Cause they want to go sit there and play with Carson Wentz, injury prone himself, and, you know, play with Ben Roethlisberger. He can't even get Juju the ball. They just let you know what they think of Lamar Jackson. And, you know, how can Lamar Jackson be a good receiver, I mean, be a good quarterback when you don't have the Tyreek Hills and you don't have the Sammy Watkins and the Marcus Robinson and those speed guys? I think ultimately it's unfair to him, but, you know, they got to sit out there and draft somebody that can be the next receiver. You know, ultimately, you know, those guys play with Baker Mayfield. He can't even get them the ball. So, it's sad, bro, that, you know, Lamar Jackson. But he just got to find the receivers in the draft and make do what it do. But T.Y. wasn't going to change life, though. But it's unfortunate, bro, because I, I think Lamar is a good quarterback. He can't throw. Give him somebody to throw to. He hit the, he hit the tight end a lot. You know what I'm saying? You got Hollywood Brown and Willie Sneed. Man, niggas ain't shit. Especially Hollywood Brown dropping the ball. Go sit down. I'm not rubbing you no more. Go sit down. Bye. You know. Want to make your guest appearance? I want to see him. Come on. Come on. Stop. No breath thing. Oh, man, I got to give you some doggy breath. Doggy mouthwash and brush your teeth, bro. But, yeah. Miles made his guest appearance. But, um, you know, it is what it is, man. I just, I don't like how they do doing Lamar, but, you know, Josh Allen, he had to get Stephon Diggs to go to the next level, but they ain't going to get a brother to benefit the doubt. Maybe Baltimore wasn't offering enough money, but, I mean, I don't know what to say. Uh, love to hear y'all opinion on Lamar Jackson's situation, the Philly trade, and how they were trying to trade up and get Wilson. I mean, I would love to hear y'all opinion on that, man, so... I mean, it is what it is. Let me know what you guys think. Don't forget me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You can reach out if you have a business question, inquiry, response, or video request. 
All my social media links there, Twitter's the fast play, and then Facebook, then Instagram. We also got a Facebook group link. I'm gonna check that out in the description. Wanna make a financial donation? Cash app CJ313. That's in the description. PayPal link there as well too. Best way to donate. Share, share the video. Appreciate the love support. But um, let me know what you guys think about. You know, Eagles trying to get Zach Wilson, but end up trading down and getting picks. And about how receivers, quote unquote, don't want to play Lamar Jackson. One time for the one time. Good for the sports TV. We go. Check out the NFL playlist once again. Peace.